Westminster, Maryland, Art in the Park, Carroll County Arts Council. Art in the Park, Westminster, Maryland. Art in the Park, Westminster, Maryland. Alrighty, we are live, Westminster, Maryland, our second live event of the day. See how this goes, gotta keep away from the music, as usual. Why are you hiding behind the sign? I'm not hiding behind the sign, I'm trying to be in the shade a little bit. Oh, okay. What's going on here today? We're live on Facebook and YouTube. Uh, what is this for? We're live on Facebook and YouTube. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what or, like what organization is it's this? It's my organization. Oh, okay. How are you doing? Good. How are you? Yeah. So I'm the filmmaker. Art. This is for Art in the Park for the Carroll County uh, Arts Council. So explain exactly what that is. Just, it's just painters or? So no. So it's artisans. Um, people make jewelry. So it's uh, it's open to anybody who wants to sell their crafts. Uh, so it's open enrollment, so there's some painters, there's some sculptors, there's people who make jewelry, uh, it's a little bit of everything. And uh, how late are you going today? Till 4. Till 4, so it's... So it's just about, it's 10.30 right now. So oh it's wow, it's early. I was just up at the uh, Hampstead Farmer's Market Grand Opening, I filmed that, filmed that live and I figured on the way home I'd stop here and see what's going on. I've never been up to one of these before. Right, yeah, so we do this uh, every year, the first Saturday in June. First Saturday in June. Excellent. So do you have anybody special that you like here today? Um, so I haven't really walked around and so okay. yet, but uh, I think they're all, if you're interested in any kind of artisan work, all it's a little bit of everything, so. Yeah, that's interesting. And you have, how many, how many stages do you have? I hear music. So there's one stage. One stage, okay. And then they, uh, there's a few musicians and they're gonna switch out throughout the day. Oh, excellent. All right, let me walk around and I'm gonna interview some people live. Okay. Try to promote, get people out here. Sounds good, thank you. Thank you. I see you smiling over here. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, where's he coming over here? Yes, I'm coming over. I'm gonna talk to everybody. So Good. you're on Facebook Live and YouTube Live both right now. My name is Richard Taylor. I, I cover events in Carroll County all the time. Oh, okay. I do Sykesville, because I live up that way, the Farmer's Market, all the live events they do, the parade, 4th of July. This morning I was at the Hampstead grand opening of their Farmer's Market. 
midweek I was up at Man Airy at their grand opening of their farmer's market. Last week I was at Sykesville Farmer's Market during the day, so that's what I do. Nice. It's like little live television in Carroll County. So tell me what the parks, recreation and parks of Carroll County, Maryland, what do you guys do? So um, we are here today to promote about some of our parks in the area. So here's well, a flyer about I'm all I'm very familiar parks. with South oh, Carroll good. Dog Park. Yes. Good. And we have our summer guide here that has some of our summer camps. And we also are holding this year the Family Summer Bash at the Carroll County Sports Complex. It's going to be on Friday, July the 15th from where, 4 till 9. Where is that, the sports complex? I don't even know where that is. Uh, Route 97 towards Hoshua. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. So it's just right there. So there's going to be bounce houses and a dunk tank and face painting and balloon art for kids, all things that they would love. And we're also having um, a live band there. Poison Whiskey is going to be there. Okay. There's going to be some food vendors and a beer and wine garden. And we're also having a um, kick and axe is coming. So there will be some axe throwing. Really? Yes. I hope that's fenced in. It's all, they have a trailer. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and I will tell you some of the other things. We uh, do a story trail at our parks. Okay. Um, so it's basically a book is taken apart and they, the kids, families walk the trail. And oh, the wow. Story. What a great idea. We have idea. a permanent one going in at Leicester Park, which we're, we're partnering with uh, the Partnership for a Healthier Carroll County and Carroll County Public Library to put that in. And, um, not one of ours, but they're going to be kicking it off soon. They're, they, they're doing one at um, Tawny Town. So oh, they are. So a little shout out to, to Tawny Town. Yeah, we have, we're on stories. two or three Tawny Town Facebook groups yes, today, right nice. now live. So, so they have one that's going to be coming out like within the next week or so. Oh, fantastic, fantastic. And people can find you. I guess you're on social media. Yes. So is it, is it Recreation and Parks or CC Rec Park? On CC Facebook? Rec Park. On Facebook? On Facebook, yes. Oh, okay, there you go. Fantastic. So I'm very familiar with South Carroll Dog Park. I work with them all the time. I'm from Eldersburg, so oh, okay. I, anytime they have a live event or whatever, I, mm -hmm. we talk to them. I'm very familiar with them. So good. fantastic. Yeah, very good. Well, thank you for stopping by. Do you yes. have any favors today? Have you well, been? I haven't walked away. Yes, not yet. Not I'm looking to go over there soon. Oh, <laughs> oh of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> That's my favorite. I go up to these farmers market and they, these people have these baked goods everywhere. Mm -hmm. Oh, I cupcakes swear. and cakes. And I always walk into them and I say, "There's another. These are all no carb, right?" <laughs> like, What's that? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Thanks a lot. All right, thank you. Wetzel's pretzels. Look at this. Fantastic. All right, let's go up here and see what's going on here at the park. You're 54, it looks like. Yes, that's me. <laughs> I'm 54. So, so you're on Facebook Live and YouTube Live both right now. Oh, hi. I'm Sarah. Come on down to Art in the Park and it's buy some resin art. I'm Ab moving to Tennessee, so I got great prices. Is that what this is? Resin art? Yes. and Yeah, I'm on Instagram and Facebook. So, so. But yeah, and I show the process on my Instagram posts. I actually, because it takes me anywhere from three to five days to create one piece. Oh, and, I can imagine. Um, it is a technique art that I use a, blow, a heat gun to actually create and push the waves and a blowtorch to get the lacing. I'll be darned. So, yeah, it is now, what kind of resin is that? Is that some kind of a polymer mix or something? It, or? I use Mass Professional Tabletop um, resin when I use this, but each piece has multiple layers in it to kind of get that depth sure, through sure. it. Absolutely. And these are Lazy Susan, so people look oh, at I this, see. but I this see. right yes. here is there a Lazy you go. Susan. There you go. And, um, Very clever. Yeah, they're actually my top seller. Is that Lazy right? Lazy Susans are, yes. I have everything for everyone. I have 
items that, and these are repurposed trays from my mother's basement okay. that I created, and that's a repurposed tray, but these are little coasters, and they're just $10 or two for 18 So I have price ranges for everyone. Fantastic. It's beautiful stuff. That, that's probably my favorite color, that aqua blue. This one here? Look no, at this. I, all of them. I mean, the blues are everywhere. Oh, yeah. This is this one. I'll show you. Look at this one over here. This is beautiful. I love the waves in this one. And look at the sparkle at the top. Oh, this yeah. is called Wicked Waves, but see the iridescent medium? Yes. And you can see that it's the layering effect through yes. here. How it goes from deep to lighter yes. to lighter, to turquoise to white, hitting yes. the beach. Beautiful work. And this is the lacing. Remember I was talking to you about the lacing um, you, you get with a blowtorch? That's it right there. Is it like bubbling? Is that yes. what it is? Mm -hmm. Yes, so the uh, bubbling. And when, when I spread it and I thin the white with a uh, blowtorch, I mean with a heat gun, and then I hit it with a blowtorch to get that effect through here. So, yeah, it's fun. And it did come in first place at the Bel Air Festival. Last is that right? Yeah. So people find you, if they don't have a QR code thing, what are the... Ebb and Flow? Ebb and Flow or Facera, and I'm on Instagram. Okay. And I'm also on Facebook um, and Etsy. I do have a site out there as well, but it's all under Ebb and Flow or Facera. There you go. Fantastic. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank that you. was awesome. You too. No, But I had a white So tell look good enough that I can they have are <laughs> it wouldn't hurt you I was gonna say so these are all dog treats edible, edible yeah. look like cookies and he makes them up all the time is that right yeah we have a little store in the mall that we open October through Christmas is that right yeah a little crab store oh I see yeah mostly Christmas because people are mostly yeah. go shopping for yeah. treats and those things Exactly. But this is a great event here. Yeah, I'm just getting started. We're actually on on Facebook Live oh, okay. right there, all YouTube right. Live. This I, is the first year we've done this one. So right. We yeah. usually do all the fall shows and everything. We're more of a seasonal store. Right. right. So it'd be nice to get out. Sure, absolutely. Exactly. Absolutely. So people find you online. Yeah. Facebook uh, or. Facebook. We had our page hacked, so we got to redo it. Oh, is that right? Someone took it over. Really? <laughs> yes. Oh, I know. And now that. it just sits dormant. So. Okay. Yeah. That's unfortunate. But okay. Very it's good. It's a secondary job for us. So sure, I understand. We have fun. Very good. Thank you very much. Enjoy the day. Yes. Oh, good. So it's a different thing to accommodate for the thing that is <laughs> yeah. maybe causing some sort of issue. Yeah. <gasps> Thank you for getting yeah, it. Yeah, that's great. That. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I like a good math joke. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> or statement. Here, let yes. me get. All right, actually, let me give you our. This is our calling card. Go to five by seven underground because we're actually an artist group as well. So oh, cool. there's some cool stuff we do online. Um, we're always looking for for new eyeballs. So. Very cool. Do you sell that shirt? Yes. $20. I don't, but I can, uh, I'll, I'll ship it. Um, yeah, you can, do oh, you have your other, you have your my individual email. card. We're like individual artists, but part of a collective. Got it, got it. Yeah. I don't. <laughs> I, you know, and it's funny, last year we had yeah.
Am I in the way? I'm so sorry. No, I want to take your picture. <laughs> How are you, sir? Okay. Good, good. You're on the front. So how are you doing? Doing pretty good. We're on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Oh, wonderful. So tell me about, are these your photographs? Yes, sir. Yep, I took them all myself. What is, what is that? It looks like otherworldly. It sure seems like it. So this is Carlsbad Caverns okay. National Park in New Mexico. Wow. Uh, kind of similar to Luray Caverns, but the difference here is it's grand. It is very big. <laughs> so there's a trail that runs through this cave. It's a mile and a half long. Is that right? Yeah. And it's also, there's a section that's called like the Grand Palace. It's 350 feet tall. So, and then you go to the very end of the trail and there's a 90 foot hole to another section of the cave that just keeps going and going and going. I hope they have a safety fence up. Yes, yes they do. They I'm nice sure they trail. would have to. <laughs> Beautiful, look at this, it looks like painting. <laughs> Yeah, I thought there were copies of paintings. Oh, no. Yeah. No, so they're printed on a sheet of aluminum. Oh, they're is that what it is? Yeah, very super clever. lightweight, very, very durable. Very nice. Um, and the nice thing is you don't need a frame. It goes right up on the wall oh, yeah. as is. Um, we've had a lot of folks, they talk about taking a strip of LED lights and putting them on the back and doing like a shadow box style. So that's uh, our best seller is the metal for sure. Because you can take this right home. Straight off the table, right. right on your wall, and away you go. Yeah, but, but the photography is phenomenal. Oh, thank you. I, I mean, really appreciate that. Yeah, I'm a videographer. I'm not a photographer. <laughs> well, two, I, two different art forms. I tell you it is, because video is very impressive when uh, folks do it right, that's for sure. Yeah, well, you, you can go on uh, Facebook, one of the face local Facebook groups. This will be on there. Okay. It's live right now, but it will be up afterwards oh, as well. Okay, okay. Wonderful. So people can find you at Sean? Uh, yeah, it's Sean Derenbacher, photography.com. It's a mouthful. Um, but yeah, that's our website there, and um, yeah, we specialize in national parks around North America. I see. A little bit more local stuff. I see. Um, but started out where I was living in my minivan, traveling around the country, uh, built it out as a camper van. Sure. So sure. did a whole lot of stuff throughout uh, North America, and uh, yeah, so now we're back home and um, just trying to get better. It's a Woodsboro, Maryland. So we're only about maybe. Oh yeah, not too far. So. What a great idea on aluminum. Yeah. Oh, now, what great. kind of a printing process is that? Is it what kind of a printer is it? So this here, I send it out to a company to do it, just because it's it's yeah, it's pretty, so spectacular. Yeah, relatively new. So they inkjet the photo on, and then do a high gloss, gloss. finish. It's I scratch see. resistant. I so see. it treats it that way. I and mean, you can touch this with your fingers. Sure. And use like a non-alcoholic, non-invasive sure. cleaner. Sure. Wipe it right off. Beautiful, beautiful yeah. work. Now that you admire his, you have to come over first and admire you once for the audience. I will. I was already over there once, but I'll come over again. Oh, no, you have to come over and look at my paintings. Oh, your, your paintings. Oh, I, I most certainly will. Do you anybody else? I, I, <laughs> I'm not like that, no. Well, these are beautiful. Look at that. Is that hawk? That's a hawk. Red tail? Yeah, that's a Cooper's hawk. Cooper's hawk, that's okay. Funny. I'm not the best burger. But from looking on photos online, I do believe it's a Cooper's Hall. Okay, well, no, I, I'm involved with uh, Frisky's Wildlife Rehabilitators. Oh, well, then can so you tell they, me I, I, No, I'm, no, I'm not an expert. <laughs> I'm just saying I do, and I think I, she's talked about Cooper's Hall before <laughs> when I've interviewed yeah, her. So that was, I found that one in Keymore, Maryland. He was down by the creek hiding in the meat. You could see where he was hiding. Yeah. Um, but yeah, he was a Western Meadow from Grand Teton National Okay. Park. <laughs> Beautiful. Beautiful work. Thank you very much. Here, yeah, because I Come want on, you to meet go. my. Let's go. No, and meet my daughter too. She's I know. from Frisky. You have to go. You, oh, she's from Frisky. Yes. yes. Go, go take her. Take me over there. Take me over there. Yes. So that's um, he was talking about the birds that he saw a photograph. I've interviewed Colleen many, many times over the last ten years. I interview her and help her with her yard sales and things. So. So now you come have to come. I got hijacked. <laughs> Did you put one of these and these two big ones over here? Oh, these are yours too? Yes. Wow.
I am the crazy artist of the bunch. The good. That's what we like. We like the crazy artist. And most of these here are mine too. These on top and these here. I see. Is this butterfly, is this watercolor? Yes. Watercolor, but it's, uh, it's lacquered. Oh, okay. So it doesn't get damaged. Gotcha. It's always the one in the collages. Right. These are really, really nice. Thank you. It's, it's amazing that you have a big painting and then a small painting, but it has the same kind of detail in it. You know what I mean? Yes. It's just like you took this and blew it up big and it became the big one. But that's not mine, that's my friend. This one I was talking about. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Fantastic. Fantastic work. Yes, I, I have been doing a lot of time. And your name is Felisa? Felisa Flecker. Fantastic. I am a professional watercolorist too. Oh, you are? Oh yeah, I have gotten a lot of awards. I lived in Florida, and that's when I went to school. I see. Yeah. But these aren't watercolor, right? Are these watercolor? They're color inks. Color inks. Yes, and acrylics. And acrylics. That's not yes. look like acrylic, right? Yeah. But your your colors are incredible because they're not regular colors I see with acrylic. Something's happened. They're different. Oh, because I know how Glenn, to colors. <laughs> I know. I was going to say, it's not the normal colors no. I associate with acrylic. That's why I was a little bit, uh, is this watercolor or is this acrylic? That, those look like watercolor. These look like acrylic, but the colors don't. That's why I was a little bit uh, interested. Very good. Those are acrylics and also some of the acrylic inks. Very good. But thank you for coming. Okay. Absolutely. <laughs> it's on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's on it's on Facebook Live and YouTube Live. Okay. And w under your name? Yes, Richard Taylor Richard TV. Taylor. Okay. But it's also on Westminster Online, all the Westminster oh, okay. groups in Tawny Town and Eldersburg and Sexual, about 10 or 12 local okay. Carroll County Facebook groups oh, all right. right now. So. Good, thank you. We thank usually you. get 1,000 thousand or 2,000 views. Oh, good, thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, no, I thank you. Making such beautiful art. Over here, Sean. Yeah, yeah, they are. Yeah, yeah. Um, but, um... Come on, come on, come on, Everywhere I go, yeah. <laughs> every event I go to, you're here. But now you have three people here. Yeah. <laughs> so you do the jewelry. I do. I do crochet. Crochet. And what about you? I do the bracelets. So you have all three here today, but the tattoo guy's not here. No. <laughs> he was. Yeah. He what? He's doing his tattoo. Oh, he's working. Of course. Of course. Today's Saturday. We have some dolls now. Look at those. Yeah. They are so cute. Yeah. Oh, look at this one has shoes on. Do they have names? No, no they don't because they are supposed to be your friend and you name them. You name them? Yes. Just like if I have a pet. Yeah, they yeah. don't have a mouth because you can tell them your secrets. Ah. And also they don't have emotion. That's why they are not smiling or sad. Oh, very interesting. Very interesting. At 25? Yes, you can have two for 25. Good morning, how are you? Let me get out of the way.
Tell me what's going on here. Uh, we are setting up prints, stickers, canvases. What for prints? So you do the printing yourself? You're on Facebook Live right now. Oh. I'm covering the art festival, <laughs> art in the park festival. So what kind of prints do you specialize in? Um, we have just a, a bunch of like smaller prints, really. Yeah, they're just like smaller prints. Uh, yes, please. And what about these? Uh, these are acrylic uh, pour paint. What kind of paint? Acrylic pour paint. What is, oh, you mean you pour, yeah, you physically pour. pour. Yep. Gotcha. Thank you very much. You're welcome. So, forging metal and carpentry are two different skill sets. Yeah, but you, you find that they intersect a good bit because a lot of your woodworkers became blacksmiths so you make their own tools. Is that? Oh, well, of course. I'm a woodworker, but I don't, I don't, metal I've never worked with per se. I've had the needs to, but I've had to hire people to come over to the house and yeah, a lot of times, yeah, lot of times they, they would make their own chisels or any type of tool they needed to do carving or whatever. Sure, absolutely. So a lot of horseshoes. I, yeah, I just threw stuff together the uh, past couple of days added to the, the metal collection. Okay, okay. And which do you like? Do you like one better than the other, woodworking or metalworking? Or do you like I them? like them both. I started out in the... The metal working in 2004 and with the Blacksmith Guild of Central Maryland here down in okay. the museum. And then later on, I guess it was like 2000, look, yeah, 2012, somewhere around there, I got into the woodworking side of it. I like them both. You like them both. They both have their, I mean, the, the woodworking tends to be a little quicker <laughs> than what the uh, metal working is. But I enjoy the metal working. Well. Yeah, I, I, I would have if I had gotten into it. I haven't gotten into it, but I'm a retired carpenter, but I still, of course, I work around the house doing carpentry work all the time. I have my shop still. Now I'm a filmmaker, but so. But so you are on Facebook Live and YouTube Live right now, and you are Homestead Forge 
in wood. Yep. .com. And thank you for your service. I see you're a veteran. Absolutely. And are you on Facebook too? I'm on Facebook. I'm on Etsy. I'm okay. On, I'm all over the place. Yeah, that's good. That's good because people, you know, they Instagram. go on. Oh, excellent. Same name? Yeah. Okay. I'll put it up there again. Homesteadforgingwood.com. Veteran owned. Thank you very much. Yeah. Watercolors by Rachel. Ellicott City, Maryland. Correct. Our daughter is the artist. Oh, I was going to say. Okay. I was just I thought you were Rachel. I, why, why did I presume that? <laughs> She's the woman. <laughs> so your daughter is the artist. That's correct. When I used to do paintings, I watercolor was one of my favorites. My, my aunt taught me how to do watercolor, my godmother. She's pretty much self-taught. And is she on uh, Facebook and YouTube? Yes. Facebook and Instagram, yeah. Use a card if you'd like to take it. Well, I got it right here. I'm going to keep this with me. So okay. a lot of times people after the fact will come ask me, hey, who was that person that you interviewed? Well, we appreciate the advertising. Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you. I, I do, uh, I promote all the, a lot of local Carroll County events, the farmer's markets, the art thing. I just. Are you going to go to Wolfstock? We're, we're set up for oh, that one, too. Oh, yeah. That sounds like yeah. fun. Yeah, I'm a big, big proponent of, uh, of uh, Humane Society. I've been working with them for years and years cool. and years and years. So I, def I definitely will be there. That's our first year doing that one. It's bigger than, well, it's probably about the same size, it's just in different, it's in the Ag Center, I think. Right. Yep. Okay, so this okay. is 35? Yes. I have a, there's a price for Hugo. Hugo has a face for the I've been here. I have started quilting, yes. I made a few Yeah, it's better for our direction. 
Tell me what's going on here. Over here we have all these beads made by um, middle school kids. Really? Yep. I didn't make any of them. You didn't make any of them, but you're <laughs> taking the credit. No, I'm just the bank. I understand. <laughs> you're on Facebook Live and YouTube Live right now. Oh, exciting. Yeah, absolutely. I, I cover a lot of events in Carroll County. Oh, yeah? Yep. This is our first time here, but there's just... So many booths, it's great. Yeah, it is. We'll Ab definitely come again. Absolutely. You didn't make the roses, though. No, of course not. Didn't even grow them. You didn't even grow them. They're beautiful. Everything looks nice. Well, thank you. So they're all rings and jewelry, bracelets, yeah. I mean uh, necklaces. Yep, rings and bracelets and earrings, necklaces, rings. Some bookmarks. Oh, bookmarks. Yep, aren't they cute? They are very cute. Oops. Absolutely. So Dana Reader, that's you the banker then? Yeah, I'm the banker. There you go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but we'll definitely come back every year. We've already sold a lot of things. It's uh it's on all the Facebook groups, local Facebook groups. West Mr. Online, Sykes Bull Online, Pawnee Town Online, New Windsor Online, Hampstead place. Online, everywhere. Right now it's live and it'll be on afterwards. All right. All Thanks. Right? You're welcome. What do you think? We're about halfway through. We're about halfway through the art in the park right now in Westminster, Maryland. Let's put that up a little bit. There we go. I just got done with this group of people back here. I can't stop for everybody. I'd be here for too many hours. But I stop at a few, a few of the places. We're going to catch a few more before we head out of here today. Lots of art here. Art in the Park, Westminster, Maryland. I know you. Hey. My name is Richard Taylor. Hi, Richard. I've covered your uh, common ground on the hills in the past. The live events, yeah. The blues night you had a couple year, years ago, I covered that. I feel actually filmed that live. I was going to send you, a, a, yeah, because I haven't. It's been so long. And, um, your name's Walt, right? Yeah. Yeah, I remember. 
Good to see you. Here's the, I this think is, it's uh, just this year. Wow. That's everything we're doing this summer. Okay. Including a live festival on the campus. I saw that. You, you're yeah. on the campus this year instead of the... Uh, good. Yeah. Since, and, you know, if it's terribly hot, we'll move indoors. Oh, okay. If it's not, beautiful or if it rains. So we've got three different venues. I just told them it was all inside. Huh? I said I just told those ladies it was inside. Because it's it both. Yeah. No, you're right, though. I was like, it's not so there. Basically, it's rain or shine. Ah. Very good. I'll be in contact. I'll get that. Great. Let me give you my card. Okay. Uh, actually, it's all right there. Okay. I did. I interviewed some of the blues guys. Mm -hmm. You had the blues night at the college, and then you yeah. you went to the uh, um, outside festival. And I interviewed, interviewed a bunch of them one time that I don't think's ever been shown anywhere. So well, that would be great. Yeah, absolutely. I'll be in contact. Thanks, Walt. Take care. Thank yep. you. I just got a message that I've used a lot of data, cell phone data, which doesn't surprise me. I've covered a lot of events this year. So from this point forward, I'll have to just film and then go home and stream live. We're going to finish up here. We are going to finish up. How are you doing? I'm How are you? Fine, thanks. Who ordered this weather? <laughs> you know, it really worked out, didn't it? it? It's like perfect. It's not too hot. There's no rain. A nice slight breeze. Right, it's beautiful. It's perfect weather. Mm -hmm. So this from now on, this is what we expect. Yep. <laughs> for all the art in the parks. We're on Facebook Live and YouTube Live right now. Okay. All right. Have a great day. You too. Thank you. All right. I think we're going to head back now. Since I got a warning from AT&T about data usage. So, Richard Taylor, live Westminster Art in the Park. As you can see, look at all the people here, lots and lots of people. Everybody later.